Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of 7 Days to Die Escalating Iron Man series. And you can see there is a wolf over there. Um, I'm going to have to go deal with him. We have a whole bunch of cobble flagstone, or sorry, flagstone blocks, mate, not cobblestone blocks. And we have cobblestone rocks. So what we're going to do today is we're going to start on the horde base. Um, I guess I'm going to have to kill this wolf first. <sighs> Sun just came up. Okay. So let's do this then. Well, this is going to be interesting. Um, he's going to come after me hard. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to shotgun the crap out of him. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's going to destroy all the meat, but you know what? That's okay. Let's jump down here on the f Ow! Really? Why? Why? What? 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 What is hurting me? Oh, it's barbed wire! <laughs> I didn't see <laughs> Couldn't... I couldn't see that. I couldn't see it. <sighs> That's always entertaining, isn't it? <laughs> jump down on the barbed wire. Um... Can I just get up here? Oh, crap. He's here. He's here. You know what? Let's, um, let's give him a little... No. Wait, why that one? Yeah. I start whacking over here, and he comes over here, right? Of course. Okay. Um, here. Let's just... I didn't really want to smash my fence up, but we're we're moving. Anyway, this isn't going to be our home for much longer. Why am I so slow? Okay. So let's get his gubbins. Wow. Oh yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so I cleaned up the uh, guts and meat and stowed all that. Now I, I came over. This is one of the potential lots for... It's either going to be this spot here. I mean, I like it. It's nice and flat. There's a whole bunch of nodes here, resource nodes too. That might bode quite well when I start digging down for uh, resources. And then the other spot I was thinking of is right over here. So maybe at the end of this road. I kind of like it here too. It's nice and wide and open. That way uh, when the horde does come, it's not they're not going to get trapped in a whole bunch of buildings and smash have to smash their way through. Yeah, this is looking like a better spot right here. So this will be our driveway, I think. Okay. Okay. What's our game stage at? What's our game stage at? 12. It just flipped. Okay. Well, that's good. We'll get a, another quest today, too, I think, as soon as the trader opens up. In the meantime, I guess... <sighs> Here, let's put the bike away. I'll just pick it up so it's not in the way. Uh, I guess in the meantime, we're going to start laying down the foundation. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make like a mealy... It's kind of a cheese base... I know the first, my first horde base is a little bit of a cheese base. Can I pick that up? Please, thank you. Because um, it's going to be a hatch corridor, like a killing corridor, but it's also going to be the entrance to my main living quarters. And then eventually, eventually I'll make a ranged horde base. So let's step this back a bit, because I want the ranged horde base to be able to connect to the regular horde base. So I want space 
This might be good right around here. Yeah, okay. So, first of all, let's start digging. What I'm going to do is I'm going to dig out a, uh, I don't know, probably a, an, a seven by three or so. And this is going to take forever, so I'll come back and grab you when I have this done. Okay, we've got our little trench, so to speak. It's just the foundation. I don't like the foundation just to sit on the dirt. I like it to be one lower so that if they decide the zombies with their with their sledgehammer frickin' fist decide to dig up the ground underneath the base, they gotta go a whole block further. And hopefully it'll be a deterrent. Okay. Let's um get these blocks down. By the way, the finding the pure purified mineral water recipe on day three. Uh, and making a, like now I just make purify water is so uber <laughs> right now. It's, it's like extremely powerful on day four to have, like, just be able to make purify water. It's, um, it's quite amazing, actually. It's quite amazing. We don't have to worry about red tea. We don't have to worry about any of that crap. And the purify water is actually... Let's take a look at it really quick. The specs. Uh, it doesn't. Okay, it doesn't give the specs there. Here, we'll just look at it. 60 water, stamina regen, cure dysentery, efficient digestion, and the duration is five minutes. It's the best drink in the game, in my opinion. Okay, so we've got our flagstone down. Now what I got to do is I'm going to have to upgrade this, so I'm going to have to use our stupid little flaming hammer and just right click to upgrade. Got to have a whole bunch of cobble on you, and I do. We should be able to get away with the first horde base being just cobblestone, like upgrade it to just cobblestone from flagstone. And that'll make it a lot cheaper and quicker to build. Trying to get um, concrete going on the base before day seven can be a little bit difficult. Okay, so now that we've got that done. Oh, the trade open too. We'll have to take a coffee break from building and go uh, see what the trade he has for us in the way of a mission and maybe uh it's also day four their stock they have new stock so we'll have to go check out see what they got uh how many was that one two three four five six and seven okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep upgrading this. We're going to keep building this up with cobblestone. That way it's nice and solid. Now I could technically just build it on the ground and give them a nice easy way to get to me and they shouldn't stop and bash on the walls, but unfortunately they might. So it's it's better to have it elevated um, at least like four blocks higher or so because then they can't actually get to you, your height. You're not at their height or at a height that they can smash a block and get to you. Okay. Just be vigilant for like roaming hordes. I know it's only game stage of 12, right? It was game stage of 12, yeah, game stage of 12, but I think it's game stage of like 24, 36, where roaming packs of dogs and bears, zombie bears can come out. It's the worst group possible that you can meet out in the wild. Uh, it's pretty much death if you don't have good gear and guns and 
Yeah. With my loadout I currently have, it would be death. And the series would be over. Uh, one of the comments with my last video, by the way, sorry for such a delay between videos. Uh, we had some issues to deal with at home here. Um, I had a bit of a, uh, well, my my 13 year old dog, uh, we had to we had to put down yesterday. To tell you the truth, it was heartbreaking, uh, but he had lots of health issues. He had a congestive heart disease for the past year, and it just got so bad this week that he couldn't breathe, he couldn't move, he couldn't get up to go eat, he couldn't drink, he couldn't go to the washroom. Um, all he could do is cough, and he was basically in a death rattle, breathing for the past couple days, and then major pain and discomfort um, and there's nothing the doctors could do about it he was 13 years old and had a bad heart but he had a really good life with us so I think that's what really matters and uh, we didn't want him to suffer anymore the last couple days he was just suffering extreme and extreme pain and discomfort and we just couldn't do it anymore so oh 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 a deer let's try and get that let's try and get it I don't think we can he's gonna spot us before we can shoot I bet just walk real slow okay let's try this from here right about there Oh, I think I shot right over his head. Let's try there. No, did I miss? I can't see the freaking arrow. Oh, that got him in the head. Nice. Perfect. Okay. Well, let's collect that. And then I'm going to head over to the trader and see what the trader has. I might go collect my gubbins at the base first to sell. So I'll meet you over at the trader. Okay, I cleaned up all my crap out of my inventory. Sorted out all the meat and stuff. Put that away at the base. Came to the trader here. And if I could grow a beard like that, that would be amazing. I mean, this guy has such a glorious beard. <laughs> Anyway, Hugh, let's see. Do you want to buy my crap? I just got this one blunderbuss. Do you want to buy it? Yeah? Okay, good. Well, we've got uh, 3,000 dukes. Ooh, 500 cobblestone. I think I want to buy that. Let's take a look and see what else he's got. Duct tape. An iron spear. The 3,400. An AK for 49. Oh man, we are close. Okay, so we've got to get some more raids done, and we we must oh, a claw hammer for 400. Nice pistol for 400. A, a, whoa! Oh, I'm just buying that right now. Uh. Okay, hang on, hang on. I, let's cool the jet Z-Lot. Jesus. <sighs> let's see what he's got in a secret stash. Learn an elixir recipe? Are you kidding me? Do more damage to bears? Okay, this guy's got... Oh, man, he's got some... Learn how to harvest brass. Oh my god, he's got so much good stuff. <laughs> this... well, good luck with that. <laughs> okay. okay. Let's um let's see what job he's got. Let's take something really close. Oh look at that. Buried supplies. It counts. It counts. Well, as long as we successfully complete one life. mission a day. What do you got in your vending machine here? Oh, Gotta buy the beef. 
You know what? Let's just buy all the food stuff. Cat food, I don't care. Rockbusters? Eh. You know what? Good enough. Good enough. And I'm going to buy that pump. I'm going to buy the pump shotgun because it's, it's just too good. <laughs> Where were you? Pump shotgun. Oh my god. Yes, please. Okay, so I don't need the dubsy anymore. Let's, um... Well, good luck with that. Oh, uh, thank you. Let's modify that. And we'll put that in the dubsy. Or not in the dubsy, in the, uh... In the oh shit. In the oh shit shotgun. Pump shotgun. Okay, so now... We should be able to sell this. Oh, it's slightly damaged. 324. Is it worth repairing it a little bit? Probably not. Let's just sell it to him. Okay. I mean, yeah, I could have kept it for parts and backup, but right now I just... I probably should have scrapped it to the parts and sold the parts. Now I think about it. Whatever. You live and learn. Uh, let's eat that cat food right now. No, let's That's sell. right. Let's get Do out the of, math. Get out of this menu. And then the rest, we will... I think the chicken soup... Yeah, see, it doesn't have a recipe thing. This has a recipe. The beef cuts have a recipe. The soup doesn't, so the soup I can use. And that'll give me five food water. Yeah, perfect. That sounds exactly what we need to get topped up scrap that okay so let's uh, uh, I'm gonna go back home here let's take a look at the uh, the oh shit shotgun here and load that up and it's got nine rounds nice and it's currently doing 13 per pellet and 10 pellets so potentially if I get all pellets on one target it's like 130 damage per shot which is which is pretty much one shot kill anything right now at this game stage except for bears i don't think bears would die and maybe dire wolf i might, might have to shoot that a couple times okay i'm gonna go back to base and drop this stuff off and then i'll meet you at the buried treasure okay i'm basically here and look at that we've got a stag over there can i do you think i can get this guy Oh, he's, he's really active and moving. Oh, don't want him looking at me. Okay. This is going to be a hard shot. I uh, can't tell. No, nope, that went over his head. Come on. Am I out of arrows? I'm out of arrows. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, I got all my iron ones. Oh, come on. This is... This might... I might not get... Oh, you know what? Bird nest. has got to get a bird's nest. Ah, freaking feathers. Give me eggs. Oh, there's a bird's nest right in the middle of our buried supply circle. Let's, um... Here, let's see if we can get up onto this rock, maybe. Oh, lots of gubbins to search. That's, uh... Oh, geez, nice. Nice. Oh, no, I startled him. Uh, okay. See you later. I'm not getting... I'm not going after him. Now, if I had a, a rifle of some sort, I could have just picked him off. But... The bow, you gotta get pretty close. <clears throat> until I get a better bow, I guess. I can see him over there. I mean, we could attempt it, but I, I can't get close enough to get a good shot. So, <sighs> let's not bother. Let's smash this out of the way. I gotta start destroying... Oh, God, is he coming back? Whatever. Let's just start digging. Okay, well, I'll come grab you when I find it. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go for it again. 
Ah, oh, I think it just went over his head. Ah. Oh, there we go. Nice. Okay, well. <laughs> Guess I'll go get his stuff. Yeah, I haven't finished digging it up. My, my shovel broke, and then uh, I had to go find some stones because I put all my stones away, so I had to go collect some stone, and then this guy showed up while I did that. So, yeah, we'll collect this guy's gubbins. And I'll go back to digging up the buried supplies, and I'll come grab you when I find them. Okay, we have uncovered it, so let's open it up. And, meh. <laughs> I already know the recipe. Darn! That's okay. Some blackstrap coffee, that's kind of cool. But other than that, whole chicken and lamb. Kind of, that's lame. That's a lame loadout. Whatever. Let's grab it and run. It's going to spawn zombies. There they go. So I think we can just save our ammo and melee these guys. The weighted head mod really works well on the spear here. Although, once they get to a certain damage point, the zombies get knocked down anyway, regardless of what weapon you're using, so, eh. I'd rather that, the, that I knock them down on the very first hit, you know? Okay. Well, uh, empty bird's nest. What I should do is after I search these bird nests, I should be destroying them so they don't catch my attention and I get off my bike to search them. <laughs> ah. Yeah, okay, where where is my bike? Over here. Okay, let's go hand this in. I'll meet you back at the trader. I just noticed right in front of me as a working stiff's tool. I think we had to come back and do this right away. The other one's popping pills. Yeah, that might be a good a good way to finish off the day is try and get some better tools. Oh yeah, back at the trader. Let's see what he's got for us. I don't care what folks say us. about you in the wasteland. You're almost well, a key in my book. I mean, the first aid kits are nice, but I think I think I'll take the ammo. So I can get that pistol. We're gonna sell that. We got 720. Um, so we got the pump, and then we want an AK. 4900. Yikes. Uh, where was it? That pistol for 400. whole bunch of bullets for it too you know what I, I think we gotta buy it it's one more gun right and I'll, and it's actually a long range weapon compared to the pump shotgun so maybe I can shoot you know stags and stuff from a bit of a distance so let's buy that I think that's a good I think that's a good decision I've got almost no money left So let's see. He's got he's got some more nine mil ammo. Buckshot. Okay, you know what? We'll just run with what we got here. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change my loadout a little bit here. And I'm gonna go back and put the stuff well, good luck with that. away at base and then we're gonna go do that working stiff tools. All right, so we're back at base. I'm just unloading. I realized that I have 2,700, so we're not too far away from getting that AK. <clears throat> hmm. That's interesting. That is interesting. Um, here, let's put this clay away. You know, I got to hold on. I'll just keep those rocks on me because I, I still got to repair stone tools. 
Okay, uh, let me just finish dumping my stuff off, and then I'll meet you back at the working stuff. Nice. Airdrop just flew over. It's dropping it off right over there, which is just in behind the uh, horde base that we're making. So that's cool. We can go collect that after, too. Well, speaking of, let's uh, try and kill this stag, or deer, with our pistol. One shot. From a distance there we go oh man we're getting some meat today we're getting some meat today yeah i just have the feeling a horde of bears is going to come running at me now <sighs> i kind of want to go get that right away too you know it's just because it's oops come on grab the right number there you go okay well i'll cut this guy up i'll Put him, put his gubbins back at base. We'll go. I'll meet you at the working stiff tools. Okay, we are at working stiff. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, this is probably a little bigger POI than I thought it was. Hmm. Well, let's let's give it a go. If we die, then uh, you know that's the end of the series. <laughs> yep. Not a big deal. Just gotta restart the game. Okay, let's give it a shot. Let's see what happens. Probably a cop fall on my head, right? Come on. Here, let's shoot off around. Come on. Come on, where are you guys? Are there no zombies in here? What the hell? <laughs> um. Hmm. Let's do the oh shit shotgun. I have a feeling that there is gonna be guys coming at me in my face. Okay, locked. Unlocked. Unlocked. <laughs> I just want to clear out the zombies first before doing any looting because I don't want to be all weighed down with gear and have to deal with a whole bunch of zombies. Oh man, look at all the resources here. This is perfect. Okay. Um, I don't know where all the freaking zombies are though. Okay, so it looks like a parkour, a jump up. How do we get up there? Jump up onto there, jump up onto there, and then over to there. Or, oh, I see, there's a lot, there's a, okay, there's a plank over there. Let's see if there's anyone hiding in the trailer. There usually is. Yep. Hey, buddy. Come by. Love the shotgun. Okay, so we'll open that up later. Oh, there's a, a ladder here. Well, let's go this way. Screw the parkour crap. We can just go like this. Oh, we got a parkour anyway. Okay. Oh, why don't I jump? <laughs> oh, I suck at that. I gotta run and jump at the same time. That's fine. There's no way to run, though, so if I hold down the run and then move and jump. Oh, see, I, I can't do it. We'll just put some frames up. I'm, I'm just too inept at, at the controls to... Uh, be able to accomplish you know what if i sprinted and jumped from there though right <coughs> yeah do a little <laughs> run and then okay i'm proud of myself <coughs> there we go come on 
I know there's more zombies. They're up on the roof or something, right? Come on, where are you guys? Really? One freaking zombie in this place? That's gotta be wrong. There's something, something's wrong. Come on, can I get up here? Come on, get up here. There we go. Really? Okay, one zombie, I guess, because it's only a game stage of uh, 12. Huh. Okay, well, let's um, take a look and see what we got. Meh. It's going to be crap, isn't it? It's just going to be all crap. I can tell right now. Oh, wait, I didn't want to repair that. I wanted to scrap it. Yeah, yeah, okay, so let's, it's all those resources though for construction resources which are going to come in handy. I mean that was more or less why I really wanted to come here. Is there something hiding in there? No? Okay. Okay, so let's, um, well, let's start looting. Break all this down. For leather, leather and wood. That's good. Uh, pick up the office chair. Can I not? No. Nope. Okay. So lock safe. got that's not as good as what we're wearing uh cold resist plus one heat resist minus one you know what i think we'll just keep what we've got on yeah okay so let's scrap that that'll go down into regular lead i don't have any other brass on me so we don't have to scrap that yet okay let's um get into the safe here See how long it takes to pick. And come on. <sighs> Second try. And zeros. There we go. Nice. What do you got? Ugh. <laughs> scrap you. Come on. Scrap you. Scrap you, and we'll just take you. Ball tops are okay, but uh, yeah, this is just gonna be. I think this is just gonna be the resources, or the only decent thing I'm gonna get out of this place. It's too low of a game stage to get anything good out of the loot containers, so it is what it is. Can I not get up there? Thank you. There we go. More super water. Love me that super water. I know that I can make it too. It's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Uh, two wrenches. That's, you know what? That's okay when I need, uh, I've already got a workbench though. Meh. We'll just sell them. No, I don't have a workbench. What am I talking about? not set up at all. I don't have a base. I just got, I'm just living on the top of a freaking store. Okay, let's um, check out the storefront. I might have to put a bunch of stuff in my bike. Oh, nice. I'll always take these. Oops, are always welcome. Let's see if I can, I'll pick up, I'll dig up all the resources at the end. I just want to get all the loot first. I mean, I should be taking all the paper, those boxes, because they have, I believe they are made out of paper and, um, and poly. Are they not? So, paper, yep, yep, paper and plastic. 
So I'm gonna need that for shotgun shells. All the paper and plastic. Oh, Jesus! Where the scared the bejesus out of me? Oh, look at that! We had. Uh, up here for us. Okay, let's get these boxes. Die. Don't need freaking die. Ooh. Getting some useful. Oh, hey, look at that. Got ourselves a hammer for construction. A grill, that's okay. Yeah, some sometimes those hidden stash boxes are actually useful. Uh, I think that's it in here though. Lock picks and nails, that's always welcome. <laughs> Two more frickin' wrenches, wow. We're wrenched up here. Uh, I think we're almost full. We are full. So let, let's go dump this in the bike. So things that can't stack. So all these freaking wrenches, the tool, the pants. Are they worth keeping? No. Let's just scrap them. Oh, had dye in it. Whatever. Uh, we'll probably repair that. So that's worth 53, repair it, and 96. Eh, it wasn't really worth the repair. Okay, so I'm not going to repair tier 2 stuff then, I guess. I'm going to take that back. We can wrench it. That won't stack. Oh, actually, they do stack. That doesn't stack, though. What else? What else? What else? That won't stack, so we'll take that. Okay, let's sort. We'll scrap that. Um, what else? What else? What else? <sighs> I like that we found a hammer and we've got a couple more. Here, you know what? That has potential to stack, so we'll throw... Oh, wait, that's a good one. That doesn't need to be repaired, so let's put that in there. Okay, four wrenches. And a hammer. I like it. That's good. Okay. Let's go collect all the stuff then. So there's all this concrete. Um, here, let's finish looting really quick. I think I got this area. Let's get this area here. Uh, murky water. Come on. Need that murky water. Nice. And oh, Something's in behind there. I don't have a pickaxe yet to go through the metal, so. Got ourselves a purse. Food? That's okay. That's okay. And I think that's it for here. Okay. And now it's all this paper, concrete, and cobble. And then we're done. Okay, I'm going to grab all this, and I will meet you back at the trader, I guess, to sell all the gubbins. Okay, I've collected everything from outside the building, or from inside the building, and now I'm just cleaning up the outside. So this is the trailer. I just opened up this working stiff box. Let's take a look. And... Oh, wait, you know what? That is an upgrade. Uh, block damage 27, we've got, yeah, it's plus two, plus two block damage. There we go. We're going to grab that. We'll scrap that, we'll scrap that. We're going to modify, uh, crap. Do I not have space on me here? Let's go like that. You know what? Let's use that really quick. Um, uh, I don't want to waste my coffees, but we'll scrap that. Okay, so now I can modify that. So we'll grab those. 
We'll modify. Put those on there. Okay. And then we can scrap that. We can repair that. And put it in our hands. There we go. Okay, let's sort. Got a few spaces left. I'm going to have to make some more pocket mods, I think. How are we doing with those? We've got one on there. So I can put one on there. So I can put one more pocket mod on my t-shirt. Okay. We'll try and have to get that made. Well, I'm going to keep collecting all this stuff and then I'll meet you back at the trader. Stupid zombie won't go down. There he goes. Jeez, trying to get back to my bike and I got ambushed. Didn't even hear him, it just came around the corner and all of a sudden he was just like right... Oh, come on, grab it. Can I not grab it? There we go. He was just like right there swinging at me. <laughs> I'm like, whoa! Okay. So what can we throw in here? Can we go like that? No. No. Okay, I'm going to go dump all the stuff bought off at my base before I go to the... Um, vendor or trader i should say to sell the crap you know what i think we'll go get that uh, drop first though so we'll go uh we'll go drop this stuff off at base i'll go get the drop and then we'll hit the trader i'm just going to wrench up these office chairs really quick so i brought them here so that i could wrench them i'm not sure if it's going to make any difference if i wrench them outside of the poi i don't think it will but let's, let's see, oops, no, that's not what I wanted. Uh, okay, so, couple, yeah, we got, we got like three mechanical parts and a little bit of leather. So yeah, that was, it's worth wrenching those chairs instead of scrapping them for sure. Okay, uh, where's all my cobble blocks? What did I do with them? There they are grab the rest of my cobblestone so yeah we got a bunch of cobblestone again so we can keep you know i'm gonna bring that um i'll grab the dukes although i i don't think there's anything yeah you know what i there is there's the ak if we can actually get enough money to get that together but let's go and let's deal with this guy I like the spear for reach. On the, these guys have really wicked reach. They hit you in the knees and break your ankles. It's uh, super annoying. <laughs> Get rid of that so I don't keep checking it. Okay, I'll meet you over at the drop. Okay, here we are. Let's. Uh, there's nothing else around here that wants to eat us right away. No. Okay. Let's check it out. Ooh, beaker! And robotic turret schematic. Yes, please! Okay, so this was a good drop. This was a very good drop at this point. Uh, that beaker is going to allow me to make a, um, a chemistry station. If I don't think I can make that yet, though. Let's take a look. I don't think I picked up the chem. Can we? No. <clears throat> I don't know it yet. That's fine. That's fine. At least we have the beaker now. <laughs> we just need to get a whole bunch of acid. Okay, so let's head back to the trader. Um, sell all these wrenches, I think. And then we'll we'll keep working on the horde base until until nighttime. We've done our. Oh, was that a? I'm picking up birds' nests as I go too, because I gotta get eggs all the time. Looking for eggs. Even late game recipes require eggs too, so it's always you'll always have to stop and search birds' nests. Doesn't matter what game stage you're at. You're going to need the eggs. You're going to need the eggs. There's some bartering food. I think it's the pumpkin cheesecake I was looking at. And 
it requires eggs, and it's a uh, it's kind of an end game recipe. So oh, that's why I should be destroying all those after I search them, so I don't keep jumping off and looking at them. Okay, you can hang around with me for a second while I go uh, into the trader and sell my stuff. I don't think we're going to have enough today to buy the AK, but maybe maybe by tomorrow. What's our... Um, we've got 2,900. And... Oh, all the stuff I want to sell is on the bike. Okay, buddy, buy all my crap that I don't want. Because, you know, there's other people in the world. Keep well, no, there's distance. not, but. <laughs> 14? Uh, okay, I'm going to repair this one. It's the most damaged one. So, a 14, if I repair it. Quit wasting my time! Yeah, whatever. Uh, or is that the most damaged one? That that was the most damaged. So for 12, we repair it. And... Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, I'm not repairing those. They're not worth the repair kits. Oh yeah, I won't take more than three. That's fine. Uh, we don't need the blunder bus ammo. Okay. Well, 3,100. Oh, Wasteland Treasures. I really want to get the AK though. Was there a cheaper one? No, they're both the same. Ugh. Another 1800. We should be able to pull that off, though. Those damn things are selling like hotcakes. Oh, yeah, I bet. You know, to who else? Because I'm the only person left alive in the world, buddy. <sighs> what do we want from here? We want the jailbreakers? Yeah, let's buy that. I the Hawkbusters. Why not? Okay. Yeah, I'm encumbered again. Whatever. That's fine. Let's head back and keep working on the horde base. Oh. So the other thing I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to lay down a bedroll tonight. So I'm not going to have enough of a base built for us to live at yet until probably tomorrow. Uh, and unfortunately, I, I think it's it's every five days or on every fifth day is when zombies spawn. Or it, it might I can't remember when the respawn for critters is. I think it's five days, so that means day five is tomorrow. If um, <clears throat> if I don't put down a bedroll tonight, I might be dealing with some some spawns when I log in <laughs> like spawns on top of me when I log in so I think we're gonna have to deal with that okay so I want to come out one two three or was that just one here let's let's just lay down blocks that's fine one yeah it was that's fine it was three I thought I was right okay so I want to put you know what let's just trench this let's just trench it we'll just trench the whole thing need to make a walkway now the object to this base is make it so that they have a clear path to me and because they're going to have a clear path to me, they're not going to want to stop and beat on the base. Theoretically. At least that's that's what I'm hoping. Okay, so let's get these down. 
You know what? I got the hammer now, don't I? Yeah! Okay, so we don't need the, that. Let's do that, and like that. Oh, much quicker. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Boom! Okay, so now... We want one, two... Three. We want two spaces in between. Let's just jump up. And then we need one more higher than that. So one, two, three. I want it three high, a three high gap before the platform. So like that. And... <clears throat> And then these guys are going to go one, two, three. And we're going to go one higher and then across. So let's, let's get up there. Let's use some blocks here. Okay. Laid out. Requires a lot of cobblestone, but that's okay. Okay, so now we'll upgrade all this. Oh, that's so much faster. <clears throat> Lying in. Okay, and then we want, let's get that up to there, and then we're going to have another one there, and then that's going to come across. So we'll fill this in. <laughs> Okay, and then we upgrade all this. skill points. So we'll check that out in a second here. Okay. Let's continue the walkway. And then we're going to build the stairs now. So let's dig this out. this right away. Uh, yeah, let's just upgrade it right now. What's our cobble looking at? Ooh, we're getting real low. Real low. We're going to have to go... Uh, smash a whole bunch of rocks. Darn. That's okay. So let's get that there, there, 
and there, and then there, and there, and I need a couple more. Okay. So I'm not actually going to build stairs, I'm just building blocks, because stairs make it so that they can run up the stairs. Blocks mean they have to stop and jump. And I'd rather them have to stop and jump. Okay, so... <laughs> I can just jump up here. Oh, what was that noise? Sounds like a buzzard just spawned in. What the hell was that? I don't see one. Ugh, it sounded like a buzzard spawned in. That was weird. Okay, so now... Let's, um... Let's change the angle on these to this one. And then... Uh, we're gonna do an advanced rotation. Yep. Okay. So I wanna funnel them... Come on. Like that. So that one's gonna be that side. Boom. And there. And then... Can we rotate that like that? And there? Okay. So that funnels them into this area. And then we'll... No, let's just... Let's just go back to the regular shape. Get some walls up. Okay. Well, we are out of cobble. Getting there. So now, what I can do is I can make some hatches. Let's just do that right now. Got enough wood on us. Put hatch, 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 hatch. Let's do four of those. Okay, and you know what? Let's turn the rest of these into blocks. Oh, we don't need that many. Uh, let's do... Let's start with 20. No, not 73. <laughs> 20! Okay, let's get these hatches down. Now, I want the... See the hinge is facing me? I want it spun around. I want the hinge facing away from me. So let's spin this. I don't know why the wooden ones do this. The metal ones face that way, this way, when you go to put them down. The wooden ones are backwards. I don't know why. But anyway, we're just going to put that one there. We're going to put that one there. Third one and a fourth one. And then this is going to be clear here. We're going to have a door here, which we can build right now. So let's... Build a secure wooden door. Oops. And then let's spin that around. Okay. There. Okay. So now we should have some more flagstone blocks available. Get that up and that up. You know what? Here, let's jump up here. Because we gotta put <laughs> One's across here. That'll stop them from jumping up. Now, the, the actual, actually, at this point, the horde base is, is ready to be used, <laughs> believe it or not. I'm just going to make it so that spider zombies can't jump up in here. Okay, so we have one. We're going to put another. So I'll be standing. So the hatch is open. The hatch is open up, and then I'll be standing here. So this one above me needs to be open. And then... Okay, so let's go like this. So that, that, and that. 
So we leave this one open, we put a wooden grate on. Let's uh, let's just make an iron, or not an iron, but a wood bar. Craft that right now. Slot that in there. Uh, I gotta do advanced rotation. And come on. Come on, right there. There we go. Okay. So this is just so that I can shoot up at the buzzards and kill the buzzards that try and get me. And we'll be upgrading these. We'll be upgrading these. But in the meantime, it gives us something. There, let's... Some iron on me, that's good. I should have probably just made iron ones right off the bat, because I've got to make iron ones now to upgrade these two. <laughs> so, I don't know, it just seems like a waste of wood, I guess. But it, whatever. Whatever. I don't have enough iron, I don't think, to do that right now, yeah. Okay, uh, let's get some more cobblestone. Or some flagstone, I should say. We'll get, um, what do we need, ten? I think that's all we need is about 10. Let's see. That up, that up. That one. One, two, and three. And then we're going to do one, two, three, and four. There we go. There we go. Okay, so... That's it. Horde base bait built. Now I'm going to continue to upgrade it with cobblestone. So that means I got to go get more rock uh, to convert. Okay, 2100. Hour 21. There we've got some stone right there. Okay. Let's go grab some. We'll see how. nasty this is in the way of uh, we'll grab some food here so we're looking a little peckish we'll do our coffee give us some stamina let's just jump up here that tree being in the rock is a little weird let's cut that down okay Notice that. And look at that. Give me a ah, stupid thing. Go. Well, oh god, this is going to take forever. Oh my. Okay, so just before night time hits, I'm going to run back to the base and I'll come grab you guys to finish off the episode. Well, on that note, uh, <laughs> that uh, was good timing. Um, so we're back at base. I'm just about to empty all my gubbins. Ugh. This is all such a mess. Such a mess. Oh, my goodness. Uh, let's see. Can I just go like that? No, why did I do that? Let's just go like that. And, yeah. Okay. Oh, why did it put my wrench in there? I had a bunch more wrenches. Oh, God, I didn't... S okay, so I gotta sell, sell those tomorrow. Okay. That's fine. Actually, you know what? Let's do that one, because it's more damaged. And nighttime falls. So that's fine. Let's um, sort this stuff. Can I not put that in there? I've got one seed. 
Okay, whatever. And I can't put that in there either. How about that? <laughs> that? No. Oh, yep. That? No. Uh, uh, okay, i got to go into a second box here for stuff. So we'll just dump this stuff in there. I need to make more cobble, so I'm going to keep that and the clay on me. Keep that on me. We'll dump that off. Uh, save that for Horde Night. Dump that. Keep that. What, what happened to my bullets? What did I do? Oh, it took them all. That's fine. Did it take all my shotgun shells too? Yeah. Okay. Blockbusters. We'll use those tomorrow. Okay, so let's get some food going. That's not food. Get some food going. We've got four eggs. Hear somebody. <laughs> ah, it's just just a single zombie. She can sit up there and do, or she can sit down there and do whatever she wants. But let's um, get some bacon and eggs going. It'll give us some more food, and we are good. Okay, so I'm going to look at what I'm going to need for... I've got two skill points, so I'll look. I'll take a look at that tonight and see what I want to spend it on. Uh, other than that, we're going to call this an episode here. Um, zombie might trigger though I might have to go down and kill her anyway that is for Z-Lot future Z-Lot to worry about I'm going to call the episode here we successfully did we completed a trader mission so we we followed the rules set out by myself um, that's all we have to accomplish each day is a trader mission we have to successfully hand in a trader mission each day okay well i'm gonna call it here guys you guys have yourselves an awesome awesome day